from the shadows. I'm Naked Ninja with another video for you. So I just upgraded the 6.2, giving you Plex support. Um, and what else on top of that? It did Plex, it did Voodoo, it did the Movies Anywhere. Um, it gave you the voice control for those things. And of course, the Amazon Video music too at the same time. So I just tried it out just by using my voice. So like I was saying in the previous video, for instance, let's try this out. So the Plex, if you have Plex, I mean, if you don't have it, it definitely got to get and put all your movies up on Plex. Rip it from your system, put it up on your Plex server so you can watch it anywhere. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Free Pass is, is where you can watch it at home, like your own media server, um, but play for the Plex class. I think it's like, lifetime's like 120 bucks. Uh, otherwise you pay like 30 bucks a, a year or something like that for it. And it's unlimited users, you can create everything. It, it works great. And you know, just Google Plex or look for videos to say Plex and how to set up and all that stuff and it's there. And, and I've been using it since it first came out, shoot, like five years ago or so. So anyway, without further ado, let's, for instance, I'm just gonna talk, I'm not talking to my, it's, if you notice if, for instance, um, here's a thing you might have questions about. If you have Google Home like I do, or Google Mini like I do, and I'm all Google, if you have a Shield TV, which is in front of what you're watching right now, it overrides, when I have the TV on Shield, it will override me talking to that versus behind me, or behind the TV, uh, like literally behind the camera here where I'm talking to you from. It'll override that Amazon, I'm sorry, not Amazon, the Google Home there, and only show up on the screen. So you're going to see it right here in the bottom left corner, as soon as I say something, they'll do it. So here we go, without further ado. Hey Google. Open Plex and play Incredibles. Okay, opening Plex. Okay, so now what it's going to do, it's going to open Plex. Now, for instance, um, you know, I'm just going to, if I, I can go to, I have different ones, of course, and all that stuff. So let's just click on Guest. Once I open this, it's actually going to pull up Incredibles for me because it's in my system. Watch. Well, of course, now it's not going to do it. <laughs> hey, Google. Play Incredibles on Plex. Okay, opening Plex. So there it is. Hey Google, pause Plex. Okay, so pause it. Awesome. Hey Google, stop Plex. Nothing's playing right now. Hey Google, stop Plex. Boom. So that's easy. Um, so for instance, it's still in, in this right now. So let's try something else. Hey Google, close. Hey Google, close Plex. Let's try another one. Let's try to open up um, Amazon Video. Hey Google, open. Hey Google, hey Google, open Netflix. Oops, my bad. Sorry, guys. I wasn't saying it quick enough. Hey, Google. Open Amazon Video. Let's see if it gives us full control here. It should. That's what part of this update was. Hey, Google. Hey, Google. Hey, Google. Play American Playboy on Amazon Video. I also need to know which device to use. Try saying that again and include the device's name. So we have a look behind me, you heard that, so we have a little problem here. They're they're intermingling or not listening to me like they're supposed to. Okay, Google. Play Playboy on Amazon. Sorry, uh, Amazon Video isn't available in your country. Okay, so you do can't do the video, so let's, uh, let's see. Hey, Google. Open up Amazon Music. All right, so I don't have Amazon installed on here, but so I'm gonna install that, so that's gonna be something I'll do. But at least you can open up Amazon app. Um, you can pretty much open up every app on this thing now. Um, okay, Google, close Amazon video. Hey Google, close Amazon video. Let's see, I'm just using this cursor real quick because I can't remember if I had, um, let's see what I have. I do have Voodoo and stuff like that. So let's just, I forget what I have in Voodoo. 
Let me see what I have in Voodoo, and then I'll just go back to the screen and, and tell it by voice. All right, let's see what we can do. We'll see. All right, cool. Now let's see my movies and see what I have, and then. All right, so let's. I'm going to try to get the accounting open up, or let's see. We'll do red. Red is pretty cool. Well, so I'm going to get out of here and ask it to play that using just my voice. So let's get out of here, back it out, back it out. Go all the way back to the home menu. Yeah, we want to exit that. Okay. So here we go. We'll try this. Okay, Google. Play red on Voodoo. Okay, playing red on videos on YouTube. Hey, Google. Pause. Stop. Nothing playing. Hey, Google. Hey, Google. Stop. Jeez. Hey, Google. Close YouTube. Hey. Oh. See, it's inter intertwining between the two. It's kind of pissing me off here. Hey, Google. Close YouTube. So, it's not listening very well. Maybe uh, I'm going to might maybe need to restart and start it again. Well, let's try this again. It didn't understand me when I say voodoo. It's, I thought I said YouTube, so we'll see here. Okay, Google. Play red on voodoo. Oh, God, not is it red. Sorry, voodoo isn't available in your country. That makes no sense, because it just said it gave support, so obviously that doesn't work. Let's try a different way. Hey, Google. Open voodoo. Open video, seriously? How stupid can this thing be? Hey, Google. Close video. Call me, you do? Are you serious? Hey, Google. Close video. So it's not impressing me right now, honestly. This is this up update is. Yeah, it says it does this and that, but it's really not doing very good at it. Let's try it again here. Hey, Google. Open Voodoo. I didn't say Hulu. I said Voodoo. See? And it put it up there on the screen, so this thing's a, a tart sometimes. And you guys can hear me what I'm saying, so, you know, this is, I guess the voicing is just not there yet. I'm going to try to, I'm, I'm going to restart it and everything else, but I, but I don't see it doing much more than the Plex it looks like so far in opening. And Amazon open other apps for you. Hopefully this gets better and, and more and more we get to control everything. Um, but that's it. Just kind of showing you guys what I found and what this update from the 6.2 for the Nvidia Shield was today that came out. Like I said, check it on your, if it's not pulling up on your screen when you first pull it up, just go to your settings, about system, pretty much, and look for upgrade updates. And it should be there for you and download the updates. Can't hurt. I don't think it's going to hurt anything. Um, so, there you go. As always, thank you for watching, guys. If you want to see more videos like this, let me know in the comments. And if you want, give me a thumbs up if you like it. And if you don't like it, just leave me a comment. It's better than give me a thumbs down. And uh, you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.